what's up you guys this is your girl Alexis I'm back again with another video the topic today is hustle hustle because we all gonna need to hustle the way the world going today we all got to have hustle we got to go out and get it we got to have two or three jobs to support our family we got to go get it. So let me tell you about my little hustle. See, I had a job that you can have a W-2 form that comes in the mail since 18. Now, I had a little gig on the side before I turned 18 because I graduated when I was 17. Some of my views, some of my subscribers know that already. But this is for my new views. So, I always had money in high school. I always had money. Now, my mama didn't give money like that. You know, she took care of the main thing. She put food on the table. She made sure those things were straight. And so, I, what I did was I babysit. See, my mom made me and my sister babysit at a young age so I was babysitting a newborn baby kind of like a newborn baby but it wasn't one so it was like a newborn baby and it was like in New Orleans when I was about I think about around five eight seven one of those two because we was way developed for our age so it was like I know y'all were like five nine and we was really developed because how my mom raised us so, I already knew how to babysit. I already knew what to do. I know uh, a lot of stuff. So, I used to babysit people's kids. And I used to clean up their house and get a little extra money. And so, that was my hustle. I was, I was never broke. And then I used to save my money. So, that wasn't like I was spending. And so, when I got to be 18, I was like, oh, it's time for me to get a job. You know, you know your hustle so real when you really want it. You go out there and get it. Now, my first job, my first job was Wallet World. I'm going to call it Wallet World. And I used to talk to this lady that used to be in the office since I was in high school. And I filled out the application. She said, well, I'll keep you on file because you're not 18 yet. And we don't really hire people under 18 because of the law. You have to be home at a certain time, and they had to get off at the job at 10. So especially when I was a basketball player, so I would never be able to get that many hours. So she was like, oh, I'll wait. So I was like, okay. So I called her. She remembered me, and she said, I'm going to give you an interview. Now, y'all remember, I was 17 when I graduated high school, so I had to – take a month off because my birthday was in July and I graduated in June. So I was like, I want this job. I'm going to go get it. So the lady gave me a list of the urine place where you go take a pee test. So I was like, okay, I know what it said. So let me catch the bus over here. Y'all, I really wanted this job and I caught the bus, but the bus didn't go where I needed it to go. It was on on the opposite side of the highway so y'all remember I did an interview so I had like a skirt on some heels and I had bought some flip-flops I'm just like okay so I get to walking in the flip-flop I'm talking about I probably to walk about three miles to try to get to this pizza's then I had to walk back the time I did all that I was just my foot was hurting me I was tired I was just like oh my god but I got the job. <laughs> I was like, yes, I'm going to do what I got to do. So I stayed on that job for almost four years. And and it was crazy. I stayed over there almost four years. Things happened, which I told y'all, stay tuned. I'm going to give y'all all the tea. I got some tea for y'all. Why I had to leave that job. But my hustle. Then on top of that job, I had another job. I went to security. And I would do that job, then I would go and on the weekend do that job. And plus, I was in school. Yeah, I went to college, y'all. I did went to college for a little bit. I would love to go back if I could pay for it by myself. I wouldn't want no grant or no loan or nothing like that. No 
financial aid. I don't want to. I just want to pay out of pocket. But my hustle was so real that I would do a 12-hour shift here. I would do a 10. I would do 11. I would do 8. And I would just be working. I've been working. Now, I cut back because I have a little girl. But nobody can tell me nothing. No man can come and say, oh, I'll, you could just be at home. I'll do this for you now, baby. I got to work. I got to work. So, this is for y'all. Man, get it into y'all bones, your your body, from your head to the toe. You got to hustle for what you want. And you got to go get it. Ain't gonna, sometimes it ain't going to come to you. Sometimes it ain't going to be handed down to you. Sometimes it's not going to be when you wake up, it's there. You got to go out there and get it. You got to be persistent with it. You have to hustle. You have to, And then... My mom always taught us to go get it. My mom always taught us to be persistent on what we want. And and like her and then especially when we had a mother, a single mother, at the time my dad got divorced, a single mother doing it all. And then when she was married to my dad, she was still doing it all. And she had four kids. So and she didn't let nothing stop her. And uh so I just wanna tell y'all, encourage y'all. That hustle game got to go up. Don't have pride and your hustle is so low. You cannot have no pride that's high and your hustle is low. Only for your pride to be high, your hustle got to be high. That means to say, oh, you don't want no handouts, you don't want this and you don't want that, you don't want ax, but your hustle is low. Your pride can't be up there if your hustle low. So I'm telling y'all, go get it. Go get it. I'm telling you, every job I went to apply for, I got it. Now, I had to leave for various reasons, but guess what? I got the job. And I'm telling y'all, you want it, you go get it. And you pray about it, you go get it. Even with my car, my new car I got. I prayed about it. And I wanted that car. I, didn't, I wasn't in a rush for it, but I got it. Because my hustle... My hustle is very important to me. Being on time, it goes in line with being you know, having a hustle. My pride, I do have pride. Sometimes I have to set it aside for my daughter. But, because I have hustle. I have hustle. Hustle is very important. You got to go get it. If you want two jobs, go get it. Switch your schedules around so you can have two jobs. If you want to take care of your child by yourself, make sure you have the income to come in and take care of by yourself. You have to go get it. And nothing is handed to you these days. You have to go get it. There's no easy cut to this neither. No easy cut to the hustle. There's no easy cut. Don't be looking at the reality TV shows and the rappers and this and this. Because guess what? They sold drugs. They did little things underneath the table that they're ashamed of. But you... Start out with your hustle. Go get it. You got it. This is your girl, Lexi. Stay tuned for another video. I'll be back to back with the videos. I miss y'all. Please like, comment, and subscribe. Share my video. Come join the family. It's peaceful over here. It's always about the real. It's, nothing, it's never to shame anyone. It's never to put anyone down. It's just to encourage y'all to do what you got to do in life. Maybe one thing I got to say, whatever you do, make sure it's you doing it for God. Because at the end of the day, and at the end of this lifetime, God going to ask you what you do for him on this earth. And that's just an encouragement to y'all. Peace. Y'all have a wonderful day.